There we go. Oh, nice. Thank you, thank you. 22 months. Why is the sound not going off? I can't hear it. That's weird. Uh, although I will say this... I don't know what's been going on. Like, my computer's been a little funky with, uh... I didn't hear it either, stream. I don't know what's going on. I don't know. That is so weird. Um. Hmm. That's gonna bother me now. This is gonna bother me now. She's not playing. <gasps> Fuck. Properties. Alert box should be on. I don't understand. This is gonna freak me out for the rest of the night. Also, why won't you go away? No, it was a fake dono. That was just a test donation. So, <laughs> sorry for the false alarm. Okay, I have no idea. Also forgot to grab my controller. Oh, okay, well, that's great. <laughs> uh I love it when everything just goes fucking haywire. Love it. This is where the sound trouble begins because I, I am forever cursed with that shit. I have the worst luck with audio. Audio shit happened with all of my laptops. Probably gonna happen with this computer. <laughs> all right. So let us continue onward as things are getting heated in this game. See, oh, every time I click on the thing on my computer I can't turn up the volume I have to like manually go in the settings it's so annoying nice. Ugh. prove your justice society find the true culprit alright looks like we gotta go to bed <sighs> we're not gonna let ourselves get ch caught when we stand by actually can I do anything Can I work oh, out? You want yes. To do it? <laughs> Good, because I... I want to get fit. Get fit! Oh, he's cleaning on to me. Aww. All right. Ooh. All right. Well then. Sweet. Haven't they found the Phantom Thieves yet? Uh oh. <laughs> Everyone's trash talking us. Oh no! Police are here again. School's famous for all the wrong reasons. Uh oh. They were there today too, right? Yeah. What do those damn cops think they are? They can't just stare us all down like that. Maybe the rumors are true. Maybe there's a phantom thief at our school. <laughs> okay, quiet down. Okay, listen up. Police are here at the school. Be sure not to get in the way. Oh, and... For various reasons, school festival got moved to the 25th. 
There was talk of canceling it, but we couldn't just do that. I'm sure preparations will be rough. Don't push yourself too hard. Rip. Not the school festival. Uh oh. Apparently the police are going to be interrogating all of the students here. Police are at Shujin. They haven't come to my school. Seems they're calling students individually out of class to speak with them. Is that we're going to get called into? Second years will start in the afternoon. Make sure you prepare yourselves mentally for this. I think I ought to be looking for the culprit, right? Who knows? Be careful, guys. You should probably not try not to say too much. They'll see through any lies in my try telling. Don't tell them anything unnecessary. Oh boy. Well then, next up is Takamaki-san and... You two will go together. Huh? Why together? Why? They'll probably have one of you wait outside. That's how they've been doing it so far. Uh, oh yeah, right. Those are the instructions the detectives gave us. Just don't say more than is necessary and try and get it over with quick. Dang. Take a seat. Oh boy. <laughs> We're sorry to take your time. This will be over quick. Let's see. Ah, yes. You're the one currently under probation. It says here you had a dispute with Mr. Kamashita. Uh, yeah, that happened. You're more hot blooded than you look. You spend time with quite an interesting group Yusuke Kitagawa and Haru Okumura? The more friends, the better, right? Well, wacky antics of those phantom kids up Sorry to today. Your time. Uh, You're getting their to reputations now. ruined. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. There's just one more thing I have to ask you. Do you think the phantom thieves are associated with this school? Maybe. Surprisingly, that's the response we get from most people your age. Thank you for your time. Your responses will serve as great reference material. Takamaki-san is next. Could you ask her to come in? I got so nervous, I almost stuttered a few times. I thought I was used to police questioning by now, too. It seems we were all asked the same questions. That's how they get you. They do that on purpose, then wait for someone to slip up. I hope you didn't. <laughs> it was probably fine. Oh, I would have been done for if they saw how sweaty my hands were, though. To think my name would come up as well. Sounds like we can't take the police lightly, either. Hey, didn't you think that detective guy was scary? Yeah, he was. Especially those eyes. It was like they were smiling, but not. I'm sorry for all of this. It's because of my sister. That's not true, Mako-chan. It's not as though I hadn't predicted this would happen. And now that it's become reality, I'm unsure of what to do. We need to make sure we don't draw suspicion <coughs> and work to clear our names. Don't mind right? me. I was taking a right. drink. It ain't your Hold fault, on. Makoto. I'm gonna try to see how far along this investigation really is. I'm worried about the police too, but as of now, anyone in this city could be a mole. They were so popular too. Haru, can I ask you to search your father's belongings for clues about a possible culprit? I, I know it may be tough. Okay. On you. Oh no, my god. No, it's okay. Now isn't the time for me to look away. Whew, sorry. As for everyone else, my drink else, hit the back of my throat. You need to be cautious just, of how you spend your time at school. So, I've decided to have you three second years join me on the school festival executive yeah. committee. <coughs> Why? It will allow us to gather without drawing suspicion. Plus, trying to blend in will only do the opposite. Uh, fine. I agree. The more time I have to kill, the more time I'll spend worrying about all this stuff. No matter what happens, I don't want to regret my decisions. Don't jinx it! It would be no surprise if they came directly to our homes for questioning. They showed up at your school after all. I should remain cautious. For now, the best option is to stay on the defensive. Drink headed out for me. Oh, it sure did. At this rate. 
Let's try and figure out who the real culprit is somehow, okay? Of course. <laughs> Somebody framed us. Nice. Oh. oh, yeah, I can watch the rest of this. <sighs> well, where's the manuscript? You can't do this. <laughs> Just keep writing. The president can still grant you amnesty. For real? Dude sounded like the boulder. Okay. Well then. Yes. I have another suggestion. Call for the arrest of the Phantom Thieves, then mobilize the police. The rest will well go as you mentioned. <laughs> Still. I'm truly amazed at the atrocious methods you come up with. I wonder what kind of people the culprits are. What's going on? All right, so school festival's been moved on Fort. my knowledge never got maxed out before like anything else because knowledge is like at least early on in the game it's like the one mm. Mm, the one thing that like you can easily max out so <laughs> whoops what do we gotta do as the school festival's executive committee help with questionnaires people want to see his guest of honor Haru can't find anything from her dad. Okay. Damn it. We don't have time to be doing crap like this. You don't need to keep mentioning it. We're doing this to keep suspicions off of us, remember? Goro Akechi. This one too. Akechi. They're mostly the same over here as well. Everyone's so eloquent when they can be anonymous. It's like they never accepted us to begin with. It would be nice if you did some work too, Ryuji-kun. He came to help us count these, right? Come on, leader. Can you tell him too? Just relax. Aren't you taking this a little too lightly? Man, I sure can't wait for to play this oh, on the Xbox here. or PC. This ain't good. Yeah, seriously, that's Criminal such a profiling. Yeah, that Lots was such a surprise. By the Phantom Thieves are mere Fuck fakes. yeah, and Persona Three Portable. And their true goal is like, murder? yo. Every I wonder if the graphics are going to be updated. Was just a warm up. Uh, so now they're accusing us of being a bunch of killers. Coming to Xbox before <sighs> Switch. So oh, for stupid. Oops, sake. Yeah, you're right. God damn it. We have the results. First place is Goro Akechi. Like, I like how Atlas knows, but what? then they're like, Akechi? nah, Xbox what fam. What are you so surprised <laughs> for? We've been mentioning him this whole time. Seriously? Not some singer or an idol? 
It's because of us that his popularity has skyrocketed. We're the ones counting the results. Can't we just make him up? We don't have to get him. People will figure that out. He won by a landslide. I knew people would vote for him, but this is way more votes than I was expecting. Yeah, versus the shakes that definitely stuck out to me for PSP game. Yeah. to avoid inviting yeah. such a clear danger upon ourselves. I'd like a little more time to think about who to ask. That reminds me. How is Futaba-chan doing? She seemed like she was looking into something on her own. Has she told you anything? Not a word. It's not that I don't trust her, but... Even one clue would work wonders for us. We should let her continue with her own investigation. I hope she finds something. Hey. Mm. In response to the police identifying the Phantom Thieves as primary suspects, Goro Akechi had this to say. Even though my opinion has been met with criticism, I've held fast that the Phantom Thieves are not just. However, I believe the recent series of suspicious deaths is unrelated to their actions. W what Did I hear you correctly? But Akechi-san, you were the first to caution everyone about the Phantom Thieves. Were you not? This doesn't change the fact that they are indeed a dangerous group. That said, I would like to express that immediately linking them to this case is far too hasty. There are still many questions to be answered here. It feels as though there is more to this. After this conference, Akechi-san announced he will be limiting his media appearances and... I wonder why the sudden change. <laughs> Super stuck in my Okuma investigation. Seriously. Let's maybe let's get our options as soon as possible. Tomorrow. Earlier the better, right? It said two heads are better than one. I can only imagine what we could produce. What are you staring at your phone like that for? Oh. Are you going through a breakup? Oh. oh. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> You're trying to show off. Don't get cocky, kid. <laughs> By the way, you haven't been causing any trouble, have you? I heard the police showed up at your school. No need to worry. As long as you're not getting involved. <sighs> well, fine. Shops open. All right, that's cool and all, but a catch you just texted me. <laughs> what are you doing right now? Finally found some free time in Kichijoji. Kichi Good, I can't fucking pronounce these names. Oh. A catchy. Thank you. He's enjoying himself. Goodbye. Goodbye. Not help us, catchy coon. Got docks on the thieves yet? Good lord. People are fucking crazy on the subreddit. Makoto, has Nijima-san told you anything about the investigation? Well, Sis actually stopped mentioning anything about work in front of me. It's possible I made some sort of mistake. Regardless, I thought over the matter of who we're going to invite for our school festival. I'm considering asking Akechi-kun. For real? Weren't you talking about how you didn't want to draw danger to us or whatever? I understand this is dangerous, but without a powerful source of intel, we won't be able to win against the police network. 
And I can no longer rely on my sister for information. Wait, is this because of Akechi-kun's police connections? You're going to use him as your powerful source of intel? Bold move. I'm surprised to hear that suggestion coming from you, Makoto. Did you see his press conference yesterday? One of his comments defending the Phantom Thieves stood out to me. There is more to this. I think he said that knowing for certain that the Phantom Thieves would be watching. Still, there will be so many other students at the school festival. What are the odds of success? It's a gamble, and the odds are less than favorable. But we can no longer afford to hesitate. What are your thoughts? Should we invite a Kachikun? Um, yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> sure. Okay, then. Is everyone else okay with that? I'm good. Whatever he says has got to be more reliable than what I've been able to come up with. It would be reassuring to gain him as an ally, rather than simply a source of information. Hold on, how are we even going to get in touch with him? It's not like we got his contact info. I do. <laughs> I have his number. For real? Could you send that my way, please? I'll contact him right away. Gotta say, I'm really not big on this Akechi deal. Now's no time to be petty. Just think of him as a source of intel, nothing more. I have a response already. He says, let me think about it. Wait a sec. Didn't he say he wasn't going to do any more stuff for the media? That's likely why he's so hesitant. What are we going to do if he turns us down? I'll keep trying. Maybe frustrating, but he's all we have at the moment. We need him to do it, no matter what. We're counting on you, Makoto. Oh boy. <sighs> Probably can't get. Oh no, I can't go places. Oh, shops open. Sojuro, why? Oh wait, this is like the special bookshop, right? That's incredible. Welcome. Oh, there's more. Ooh, kindness, charm, knowledge, proficiency. Yeah, we need more kindness, charm, sure. Knowledge, sure, why not? Yeah! Uh, Yeah, I guess we can hang out with Owai because this is about to rank up. That's gonna be super important. Oh, whoops. No. Although, actually, let me sell some okay. stuff. Never mind. I have Go nothing again. to sell. What's up? Good. Actually, you know what? I haven't been to Mementos in a hot second. Underground business deals. Ba -ba -da -ba. Uh oh. No. Oh. Sussy business, man. Efficiency went up, but uh, I don't fucking need that right now. Later. World famous fail. <laughs> Hello, Good hello. morning. Um, you well... sitting well? You look tired. Are you okay? I'm fine. Yes. 
School festivals tomorrow. Oh boy. Hey. Oh boy, a catchy's coming. VA, uh, Billy, Billy commits, 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 yeah, he just passed away a few days ago. <laughs> Poor guy had stage four colon cancer. How about you? Mm -hmm. So upsetting, too. He was only 35, like, man. This is it. So young. All right. Yeah, for real. Nice going. I mean, I kind of remembered hearing about him mm. being, like, being sick. I didn't mm. think it. I don't think it happened so quick. Yes, may he, agreed. May he rest in peace. He lived. I'm sure he lived a very good life. Good, good, good VA. Hey, my charm went up a little. Cool. Um, his voice will live on in these in these like dubs and me and um games. Any word from Akechi? Yeah. have one of my favorite dub lines for the love of god drop the meat honey i'm home a catchy you're back awfully late oh bro how has business been for you lately a catchy you bastard take a look around is the nijima lady doing well unfortunately we haven't seen each other lately we had a difference of opinion what are your thoughts representative shido it doesn't surprise me that people say our country is lethargic We've let these phantom thieves run amok. That man's voice. And because they've targeted only prominent figures, our government leaders have been hesitant to act. I apologize for any concern they may have caused, and will henceforth search for an apt countermeasure. That politician's really honorable. I like how quick he says he's going to do everything. This is an important undertaking. And one I intend to confront Calm down, Mr. with every asset available to me. <laughs> the selfish criminals enacting this social reform are in fact the ones most deserving of reformation. Answering to the interests of the people as hastily as possible is my natural duty as a politician. Man, this guy is admirable. Rampant political scandals. <laughs> thieves on the loose. As sad as it is, this is the state of our nation. We must resolve this problem. And I assure the people of this noble country that I will do just that. I feel like I've met this man somewhere before. What are you standing there staring off into space for? You're creeping me out. <laughs> ah, it's nothing. I'm not worried or anything. You're just blocking the store entrance. That politician is honest and carries an overwhelming amount of charisma. It feels like a trustworthy leader for Japan has finally come forth. Don't you think, boss? Sorry, I wasn't listening. Criminals, hmm? Well, that must be how he sees it. However, that is ignorant of their true nature. Hmm. 
Don't like politicians. It isn't about liking or disliking them. It's more about how he suggests the Phantom Thieves be crushed when they've yet to be arrested. If this Sukumara incident was not the Phantom Thieves, if they only change the hearts of criminals, then even though they can't be considered innocent, perhaps my goals are not so different from theirs. Hmm. But they are innocent. <laughs> I knew there was something special about you. Ever since the first time we met, I feel as though I could tell you anything during our conversations. Oh, that reminds me. I've been invited to a panel at Shujin Academy, and... Ah, wait. I'm sure I'm you know that. I'm bro, it's not a panel. Considering Everyone's it's just such a good opportunity, talk over you. <laughs> I decided to accept the offer. Thank oh, shit. The coffee. It was oh, he's, oh, he's, he's, he's going to be there. Like I'm happy I could see you. I'll be going now. Oh. The kid was going on about some real complicated stuff. He's probably a fair bit smarter than you, huh? Thanks, Sojiro. He accepts the invitation. Well done. First step is done. Much obliged. save the ring for later. Oh. Oh, you can shoot them away. Haha. <laughs> hey! Yes, I would like to read the book. Kindness. Make sure you close up. Yes, please. The festival seems to be a success. There's definitely a lot more people than last year. Well, yeah. This place got famous and all. Phantom Thieves, Kamoshida, Principal Kobayakawa. On top of that, we got a catchy as a guest. There may be police officers in plain clothes, too. Actually, they probably are here. We better be careful about what we discuss. Acting like normal students is going to be important. What do you normally do at a school festival? I ask myself that all the time. <laughs> Look around at the exhibits and eat stuff? You mean high school anime without Should festival? Have rules for this kind of thing. Walk around and hang out? Like when we went to the beach. Courage is right. Um... Hanging out isn't precisely the focus of the school festival. More importantly, it's possible that both your names have come up during the investigation. A number of the teachers had been questioned before, and even we were interviewed the other day, too. Don't let your guard down too much. It's true that the initial members have been at this for a long time, making it easier to get tracked. All right. Now, now, let's leave it at that. We just need to be mindful about what we're saying, correct? Oh, um... <sighs> you seem to be having quite a lot of fun, Haru. You did mention that you were looking forward to this. <laughs> I want to go around with everyone, and eat at the refreshment stands. <laughs> this will be a great change of pace from all the nasty stuff lately. Shall we head off to the stands then? Yeah, let's do it. All right. This is your first time at our school festival. They're pretty good, from what I've heard. <laughs> I know a great one. Follow me. This is the place. 
Meet Takoyaki? New customers! I'll show you all to your seats. So, it's your classes stand. It's still a refreshment stand, isn't it? It's like a deserted island here. Well, I guess it's good for talking since there aren't any people here. <laughs> We heard a lot of rumors even on our way here. I still don't get school festivals. Like I <laughs> act normal. All the anime I watched Nothing on normal world. about this anymore. Welcome home. May I take your order? Take my order? What happened to the maid atmosphere? <laughs> there are a lot of odd flavors. Stick to a normal one. I bet they I'm so sorry. We sold our last normal one to the previous customer. The hell? Well then, I'll have the mentai cheese takoyaki. I'm sorry. We're out of cod, bro. Uh, <laughs> then how about the squid? Um, we're currently out catching squid. It'll probably take another five or six hours. Jeez. That doesn't even sound remotely possible. Ain't this whole menu just a sham? <laughs> Actually, we spent most of our budget on making the maid costumes look nice. We didn't put too much effort into the octopus. Oh, I can see that. Yuji, you're making a scene. Then, what would you recommend with what you have now? That would be the Russian takoyaki. We'll have that, please. Russian this takoyaki. This will take a little time. Uh, let's forget about the octopus and get back on topic. On that note, hearing Kamoshida being almost treated like a victim makes me want to eat my stress away. I've even heard conjecture that the principal was targeted for reasons like he knew too much. <laughs> Ryuji going like Karen mode. <laughs> about Goro Akechi's popularity. All thanks to the Phantom Thieves. You know, did that Akechi guy agree to show up here because he believes we didn't kill anybody? Or he may simply love large gatherings. Oh, true. He didn't seem like he minded being pampered by the media at all. We plan on stealing intel, but we might fall into another trap. I'm gonna be bummed if that happens. Hell no. I'm of the same mind. Still, it doesn't change the fact that we don't know what Akechikun is planning. Thank you for the wait. Ooh, it's fresh made. Lies. I heard a microwave go off. <laughs> well, it's not like I was expecting crispy takoyaki at a school festival or anything. So, what makes this a Russian takoyaki? Could there be jam in it as a secret ingredient? That sounds quite delicious. Well, one of these is special. Uh oh. Uh, oh, one no. of them's obviously red. That's gotta be the one. Dude. Don't tell me the Russian part means... It's like, going for the obvious one is manly. I is that so? Oh my god, Morgana. Well, I'd prefer the most beautifully shaped one. Mm, but all of them are misshapen. <laughs> oh, aren't you all going to eat? I think I'll go for the special one. Oh no, Haru, don't... Wait, is she honestly going for it? Do you want to go for the red one? I'll take it. Ooh, impressive as always. Yeah, sure, fuck oh, it. Everyone's all here. <gasps> oh shit. The, the panel isn't until tomorrow, uh, though. I came to check out the venue. I can't make any mistakes since a lot of people will be present. Someone's eager. But people ended up recognizing me. Everyone bombarded me with questions. That's because you were sloppy. I grew tired of the baseless rumors they kept bringing up, so I escaped to where there weren't any people. <gasps> oh I'm shit! I'm going to have one of these. Oh lord! <gasps> the special one. Let's just call this my performance <laughs> Let me just... fee. <laughs> I'm gonna take your fucking food. But... It's fine. Ranji. <laughs> it's quite. <the> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh shit. One bite is a bad My fried idea. tofu. <laughs> my throat. This is. Oh, oh, my stomach. It burns. Are you okay? Do you need water? I, I, I'm. I'm fine. 
fine. I just love uh, spicy, spicy stuff. <laughs> <laughs> hey, does he sound broken to you? Well then, I'll, <laughs> I'll see you uh, t t tomorrow. Holy shit, Mans is dying. <laughs> wow, he's really trying to hold it together. He's waddling around like some comedian. It's like he wants to get picked up for some commercial or something. But did he truly come to simply check the venue? Uh, this isn't good. I keep suspecting every little thing. I know what you mean. I'm doing the same too. I need to do my best tomorrow. We need to somehow get him to be our source of intel. I'm gonna pull this off no matter what. That a catchy guy. When he got here, didn't he say that everyone's all here? Ooh. Everyone? You're here just imagining things. Uh oh. So I guess we got through all of it, okay? Yes, but the associated mental fatigue was extraordinary. Being cautious takes a lot out of you. Seriously? I think I'm as tired now as I am after midterms. I didn't mind any of that. I just love seeing that detective gulp down the special takoyaki. <laughs> I had fun as well, since I got to spend time with you all. What would you like to do now, Haru? Walk around a little more? I appreciate the gesture, but I'm satisfied with stopping here. Why don't we go home and rest up? We'll have to deal with Akechi-kun again tomorrow, after all. I have to agree. What will his next move be? What will he do next? Oh? Wait. Yusuke's missing. What do you wandered off to? Always doing whatever he pleases. Let's head back. Uh-oh. Yusuke. Oh. Um. Excuse me, you are Dr. Takuro Maruki, correct? Uh Yes, I. <laughs> Just one step forward. I, was, uh, I do apologize for interrupting your day, but ever since Reiji and Anfra spoke with you, I grew, I'm grown quite intrigued. Now I wish to speak with you as well. Quite. Indeed. Oh my god! <laughs> Hold on. Should I put this? Your enthusiasm is appreciated, but I suspect there's a huge misunderstanding about what I do. How about it? Why not try out my counseling yourself? Me? Of course, there's no charge. Well then. <laughs> <laughs> I see. I see, Ramadara Mesamas. It's in the past. However, how curious. I never imagined counseling to be like this. Well, uh... <laughs> hmm. I see. Indeed. I really hope I get Maruki's uh, theme maxed out before he oh, leaves. Yes. I'm like really nervous. I haven't spent enough time I... with him. Hmm. All right. Thank you. Well then. Tomorrow's the moment. The Legend of the Lost Inori. <laughs> hmm. Photo time.
We get pictures of us. That went straight to the trash. Oh no. <laughs> nice. I'm gonna finish reading this book. Make sure you up. Wow. No oh boy. Well then, we will now begin today's panel. Our guest of honor is Goro Akechi. I feel kind of bad considering how many people have gathered. I'm sure you all would have been happier to have a singer or a mascot appear, wouldn't you say? No, because everybody wanted you. We'd appreciate if you could tell us about your experiences with the notorious Phantom Thieves. It'd be wonderful if you could let us hear more about your actual investigative process. I'm not used to being the one interrogated, so please go easy on me. How much do you think he knows? He talks about the Phantom Thieves are dangerous, yet he says they haven't committed any murders. Either he has an idea who the true culprit is, or he has uncovered the identities of the Phantom Thieves. Come on, Makoto. You gotta get it out of him. As much as you're allowed to say, would you tell us how far along your investigation is on them? Getting right to the point, I see. Well, if it's as much as I'm allowed to say, then everything on TV and the internet is all of it. We don't have any leads yet, and the methods behind their crimes are still unclear. I see. Even with this country's power, arresting them is proving to be difficult. Is that the case? I wouldn't phrase it that way, but, well, something like that. Thank you for answering that question. By the way, it seems you've denied a correlation between the Phantom Thieves and the murders. Why the sudden change? Until now, haven't you upheld your stance that the Phantom Thieves are dangerous? How are you so positive that they haven't committed murder? Are you a little too comfortable interrogating people? Why it's as if you're a prosecutor. Hmm. Uh, excuse me. This is something I've personally been interested in, so I couldn't help it. But won't you tell us? What reason is there that you'd claim their innocence when you previously stated they were unjust? Mako-chan's really pressing for an answer. She's pelting him with questions. Every person whose heart they changed have truly been criminals, including Okumura. Why then was he the only one who needed to be killed? Why is that? I must admit, I couldn't deduce a reason. That's why I believe that case should be thought of as this if This is a like part really serious for like a school festival, like damn. If this is all hypothetical, mind you. If the Phantom Thieves are the ones I know of, I can't possibly imagine they would kill anyone. Your comment just now. Does this mean the police have already identified who they are? Uh oh. Oh, no. The police haven't gotten that far yet. But I have my own conclusions about the true identities of the Phantom Thieves. He's got to be bluffing. Pipe down. He's lying, right? But if it's the truth... You're not going to ask me who they are? It may have repercussions on the investigation. Are you sure you can share that with us? Yeah, this is like sensitive information. Like what? <laughs> so announcing that here would pose a problem. However... There is a possibility that everyone present will hear the truth before the police or media. The truth? What's he planning on saying? That's quite the confidence you have. If you're so certain, then very well. I'd like to ask you then. <laughs> Who do you think the Phantom 
<laughs> this may or may not be confidential information. Fuck it. Uh, go for it, Kachi. Idiot. Oh, there's no way he could have any evidence. They're people you all know. <gasps> the identity of the Phantom Thieves are. Uh? Oh. Oh. Uh, it's mine. I apologize for the interruption, <sighs> but I can't turn off my phone. <laughs> <laughs> Is there a room I may use? Oh, fuck. There's the PE faculty office. I want you to come too. <gasps> There's a matter I want to discuss. Oh, shit. Your friends from yesterday are here, aren't they? Can you bring them too, if that's all right? Oh. Did you set this up? We only have 10 minutes, you know. <gasps> What do you want to talk about? <gasps> no. Holy That's shit. That's gotta be shocked. I have video footage too. We're like Please. phasing Let's into reality. Holy shit. All of you can go to that other world too. Yes. Oh. I'm afraid I don't know what As you're talking I just about. Said, I know everything. I also know that when you traverse over there, your appearance changes as well. It's because of those mysterious powers, isn't it? I found out about that world about a month ago. Oh. This had been installed onto my phone without my knowledge. <gasps> oh, shit. Dude, it's the nav. When the app activated on its own, the scenery around me suddenly changed. Quite frankly, I still can't believe it myself. But from the look of these photos, all of you seem quite used to it. We've been listening to you blab on for a while now, but cut the delusional... All of you are acting as phantom thieves in the metaverse. I can say so with conviction because I have the same power as you. <laughs> it's not us, bro. No matter what you say, my belief won't change. In all honesty, I've been curious about you since the time of the Matarame case. But to think it would end up like this. We didn't kill anyone. I believe that as well. How can you be so sure? Because I saw another. The real culprit. Uh, for real? Who was it? I couldn't identify his face. He had a mask on, after all. Actually, when I took these photos, I entered that world, too. That's when I saw someone else moving about, besides all of you. He shot at me the moment he noticed me. Oh, shit. That's who killed President Okumura? Most likely. At the very least, I was almost killed by him. I can't die here. I need to determine the truth. When those thoughts overcame me, I awakened to that power. A most fortunate accident. This guy has a persona too? This cat. Oh shit. I swear, it just talked. Morgana, our teammate who taught us about the metaverse. <laughs> really? This is unbelievable, but it is true that you know things that I don't. Say, Morgana, were you also the one who instructed them on how to change people's hearts? I experienced that world too, but I still haven't solved that mystery yet. We go in the metaverse, we call them palaces, to steal the core of their desires, their treasure, and those whose treasure has been stolen have a change of heart. Ah. <laughs> There's certainly no way anyone could figure out such an M.O. Anyways, back to what you were talking about. Anyways, in this fucker. Mess of that guy? <laughs> Although I don't completely understand the method, all you do is simply reform people. Someone else is behind the murders. However, the police have decided that the Phantom Thieves did it. They'll arrest you at this rate. They're going to treat me as my father's murderer? I can't overlook such a grave mistake. Which is precisely why I want us to strike a deal. Mm. I may be able to save you from this situation. A deal? I would like you to cooperate with me on investigating the truth. And if we decline? 
And I think I'll have to inform the police about all of you. Oof. Along with that video I mentioned. This ain't no deal, it's blackmail! Say what you will. This is the method that I believe is correct. The justice I uphold will not tolerate criminals who kill people at their leisure. Mm -hmm. Justice. You've heard that Sai-san is the one spearheading the investigation about you phantom thieves, correct? The higher-ups are concerned only with settling the case. They want to capture the culprits behind the psychotic breakdown incidents and end the commotion. Those are the ones who are putting pressure on Sai-san. I can only imagine her impatience. What of evidence that we did it? How do they intend on proving it? Even if there's no objective explanation to the method, it's over once causality is established. Sai-san can't make rational judgments at the moment. If she were to be cornered, well... She may even make up a confession. Make it up? So... They're gonna make it all our fault? Just cause they feel like it? We haven't killed anyone though! And we're still going to be arrested? You'll be found guilty if you're caught. Mm. And it will be treated as a very serious crime. Bullshit! None of that makes any sense! Unfortunately, there's nothing I can do alone anymore to stop the flow of things. And that's why you want our cooperation. Yes. In return, I'll turn a blind eye to what you've done. Those are my conditions. That said, I ask that you disband the Phantom Thieves after this. Oh. What should we do about Akechi-san's proposal? Let me think it over. I see. I don't think it's a bad deal, though. Well, you don't have to decide at the moment. Considering this is you we're talking about, I believe you'll come to a favorable reply. I'm glad we could talk. It's been a while since I've been able to spend such a meaningful time like this. I look forward to your answer. It was definitely worth coming today. For various reasons. Mm -hmm. We should be getting back. About that. I'm sorry. Would it be acceptable if we ended the panel here? The reason why you called for me in the first place was because you wanted intel. Correct? My business is concluded as well. I'll deal with it somehow. Damn it! He had complete control over us! Hey, they're going! Oh. What's happening? I'm sorry about the sudden break. An urgent task. What was that transition? So, I truly apologize about this. But I'll have to end things here today. To make up for the time that was planned for this panel, the Rakugo Research Club will instead be... I can't say anything in detail regarding the Phantom Thieves investigation. We're going through flashbang. The protect is about to go ape shit. <laughs> Was that really our best course of action? He totally used Makoto's suggestion against us. Indeed. We Bruh. had to get into that. <gasps> okay, so it worked. Like this. So what? We'll just Sorry, the sound. Deal. I'm testing the sound thing. He's so got worked. evidence on us. We really don't have a choice. Damn it! What are we gonna do? <laughs> calm down, Ryuji. How am I supposed to calm down? What are we gonna do? What's done is done. We'll have to cool our heads and think more on this. We must make up our minds by the time he contacts us again. We need to give this a lot of How thought. can I play bruh? Uh, so there's like a little sound alerts thing. Uh, if you're on mobile, there's like a little Similar occurrences followed in succession chat with a little emote this spring. thing. There's also other sounds. Don't, don't go too crazy with it now. <laughs> several incidents have occurred once again. Furthermore, new information has come to light about the suspect who suffered sudden mental shutdown. He had received a calling card from the Phantom Thieves. Mm. Why did Futaba have something <gasps> like this? Oh shit, he found it. If a calling card was delivered, we can only assume that the Phantom Thieves are behind it. 
If so, those occurrences back in spring can be attributed to them as well. Moreover... Uh-oh. Sojiro knows. I knew it. She's... Oh, God. The post-festival party is about to begin in the gymnasium. Please join us, everybody. Post-festival party? I thought this thing was over. Eh, nobody invited you to it, so let's just go home. Huh? Senpai, aren't you going to the post-festival party? I was about to head out. Since we've run into each other on our own, why not go together? People say these kinds of events should be enjoyed with others, so let's go have some fun. Okay. I'll do it for her. <laughs> it seems like it's already begun. Let's get in there, senpai! Oh. <laughs> and now it's time for your favorite shooting tradition. Oh, that's cute. What's the shooting? Student sharing special. But before that, we've decided to change. We're going square dancing. <laughs> What is this? Oh my god, they get to fucking backflip! Let's go! What? What the fuck? I did. It's showtime. I love school dance clubs. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna stand here. Okay. Why am I- Oh. Oh, she is- Okay! Yeah! Let's- <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Holy shit. Hey, you're Yoshi's oh. son, right? The first year? Busting the fucking move. Got it. I'm in. Senpai, I'll be back soon. They've asked me to help them with something. Oh boy. See, the dancing games not teach us anything. Oh boy. 2D cutscene? Okay, okay, okay. Aww. Oh. Oh. See, if she's a gymnast, like, dancing would probably be pretty easy, I'd assume, for a gymnast. Yo. That's crazy. She just played everyone like a damn fiddle, but here's a here's a dancing moment. Yeah, I'm actually really glad we got a quite a few 2D cutscenes in this game. Aww. She's trying to impress me. Get in there. Get in there. Come on. Oh, you just- okay. I love the- 
I love the party with Kasumi to cool off a bit outside. Aww. That was so exhausting, but what a blast! I feel like I danced my heart out back there. As great as I expected. <sighs> Thank you. Professor by doing the wow. work. That dance was amazing. I know, right? I was totally blown away. Hi, Yukiko. <laughs> that sounded just like Yukiko. Oh my god. Uh, it's my dad. He's telling me to come home before it gets too late. Sorry to leave you like this, but I have to get going. Want me to walk you? Uh, uh. Thank you. I'll be all right, though. The post-festival party was so much fun, especially with you. Oh. See you soon. She's such a sweetie. Like, uh, my heart. The gym's quieted down. Looks like the dance is over. I had to head home. Or I'm about to get my ass kicked by Sojiro, I assume. Post festival party's about to begin. Would you like to go together? I should I head to the gym? Did I actually agree? Huh? Joker bus out the default dance. Alright, that was a great performance by the dance club. Everybody give them another. Bro, I'm supposed to be going home! Thinking about what Akechi-kun said. I mean, it'll be alright. I, I promise. <laughs> it feels like nothing bad could ever happen when you say that. And now it's time for your favorite shoujin tradition. The student sharing special. What the fuck is this? Round of applause, everyone. Sharing special. Sharing? I never knew we had such an event. Alright, who has something to say? Anyone? Oh Anyone? lord. Oh god. Oh, he's going to choose? I wonder who it will be. Oh, for fuck's sake. How about that fluffy haired girl over there? Oh. <laughs> huh? Is he looking this way? Well then, come on up. He's talking to me, isn't he? Yeah. You're up. So it really is me. Come, come! God, that's terrifying. Well, I'm going. And your name is? Wait, you're a Kumara Oh, Jesus. Um, yes. Come on and humiliate yourself in front of the school. Go on. Confess your sins. Uh, you sinner. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Don't spill too much. Let me give you a question then. Do you think the Phantom Thieves are really Shujin students? Huh? Oh? Man, he's going in for the kill. I mean, they are uh, your father's killers. Uh, yo, wow, We're okay. Haru's in trouble. <laughs> Rush the stage. <laughs> oh shit. Well. Oh. 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 Please, D. I've always loved you. <laughs> Tell us, who do you think killed your dad? <laughs> yes, seriously. <laughs> My god. Do you have a boyfriend? It worked. I think it was him. So, Akumura san, what's your relation to this guy? That wasn't what we were talking 
<laughs> oh no. My, she's quite flustered. Is this a hot scoop? But I'm a gentleman. It hurts my heart to bully such a sweet girl. Well, did you all enjoy our blushing beauty? Thank you very much, Okumura san. Jesus. Man, fuck this sharing special. That's terrible. It's finally over. It turned out to be more like an interview party, huh? I still can't believe you said that. <laughs> well, I mean, you're in trouble. Gotta get you out of it. Huh? Right. At any rate, I'm not sure what I would have done without you. Thank you for saving me. You're a mysterious person, but you're so reliable. I think the two of us will get along quite well in the future. <laughs> <laughs> As they say, oh, I'm who assuming... knows what may lie ahead. For now, I'm worried about what happened with. Oh, I was thinking this would start but the uh, say, social. My first post-festival party was quite fun. Social no, link confidant. I guess it's my last too. No. Here, I'd like you to have this. Oh. I. Bought it earlier. Oh, it looks delicious. <laughs> now then, let's go home. Oh, I thought that would start. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. Oh shit! Welcome home. You took off somewhere during the festival, huh? I tried to find you, but I gave up pretty quickly. Utaba? What are you doing here in front of the store? I needed to calm my brain. My thoughts were getting out of hand. Ooh. Not just a catchy, but other stuff too. We're in deep trouble unless we can do something soon. But anyway, I was just thinking about going inside, so your timing is perfect. Let's go. Uh-oh. The mass media has been causing quite a commotion lately. No countermeasure for the phantom thieves, the sorry state of the police, destruction of safety. They're saying whatever they want. So, how's the investigation progressing? Any clues yet? Nothing that leads to a firm conviction yet. What's going on here? Didn't you say that you were sure about closing this case? And I thought I told you that failure won't be tolerated. <laughs> well, this is troublesome. If things continue at this rate, never mind a promotion. Oh I'll no. Have to let you go entirely. But sir, I had high expectations for you, but it seems this task was too much to handle for someone so young. We may need Eesh. to reform the operation as well, since the selected personnel for this... Please, let me see this through to the end. This case is something that I've always... I know that you've been in this for a while now. Even before the police spared us the staff for it. If you can manage an arrest, I've made special arrangements so that you can question them personally. That's what you want, isn't it? Mm. The leadership of this country is about to change. We can't let this case carry over into their term. I'll make myself clear again. Failure isn't an option. We need results. I understand. You're allowed to take some bold measures if you need to. We need good results, no matter what. Oh. One more thing. If the unexpected happens to occur, contact me immediately. The unexpected? To you, sir? I said that failure isn't an option, didn't I? Yes. Everything is proceeding as planned. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh oh. Sojiro? <gasps> I was cleaning up and found this. Oh, fuck. 
This is a calling card, right? I read about it online, too. Y you went into my room without my permission? I'll apologize as much as you want later. Oh. So, what is this? That's... Is it something to get flustered over? I knew it. This isn't just some game you're playing. Why aren't you saying anything? Why did you keep it? I mean, it was memorable. Oh, fuck. Explain. Explain. Can't tell me? Explain. Uh oh. Hey, if this keeps up, Futaba's. Don't blame Futaba. Oh? Oh, fuck. I'll get right to the point. Is this a real one? Did they trigger a change of heart in you? <laughs> oh. How about it? Ever since Mom died, I... There was n no exit. I was trapped in, in a labyrinth of my heart. I knew I had to leave it. But I couldn't do it by myself. Futaba. Here, sit down. I can at least listen to what you have to say. The Phantom Thieves saved me. They stole my messed up heart. It's the same as Mom's research. They changed my cognition. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> Wakaba's research about altering one's cognition. I wondered about it myself, too. Still. When did you notice? When she said she was going to go to the beach out of nowhere. And even the doctors had thrown in the towel. <laughs> mm. At first, I just chalked it up as other kids being a better support for you than any adult. But as I kept watching the tabloid shows here, day in and day out, a thought crossed my mind. I thought, your case kind of seemed similar to what these phantom thieves were doing. Wow! I'm still your guardian, you know. I'd never overlook such a drastic change in your behavior. So, Jiro... Think that Wakaba's research and the Phantom Thieves changing hearts were about the same thing. <sighs> Back in the day, I used to be a government official. What? My job was to be the bridge between the country and the lab that Wakaba worked at. It's around that time that I got to know her. Mm. She said something odd when we were out drinking that one of these days she might die a bizarre death. Who wouldn't take that as a joke? I just laughed it off. But it happened exactly as she said. If anything were to happen to you, I'd feel like I let her down. There's something I want to ask you. Judging from your attitude, you knew about this calling card, didn't you? You should have known that Futaba had a change of heart through the Phantom Thieves as well. Is there a connection between you and them? The first incident of a change of heart was a teacher at your school. Oh boy. The kid who brought that painting here was a pupil of that artist who had a change of heart, wasn't he? And then, there's Futaba. You always seem to be linked to these incidents somehow. Oh, shit. Got anything to say? Oh, fuck. Um, sorry for keeping quiet. You know what people call them? Criminals. Why did you introduce such dangerous people to Futaba? That's not true! I asked them! That's why he saved me! He stole my heart! Asked? Stole? <gasps> oh, sh <laughs> Futaba. Wait, are you saying that you he's spilled the one the who beans. changed your heart? <laughs> he doesn't just deal with the phantom thieves he's actually one of them <laughs> you're pulling my leg aren't you this is no joke sir are you serious you 
really are a phantom thief? Oh, for crying out loud. Sojiro! So, basically, I've been sheltering a phantom thief for the last six months. And on top of that, Futaba's involved too. What the hell? I... I want to find the culprit who killed my mom. Wait, it killed? She was killed. I... remember it now. Stop this nonsense! Why won't you believe me? Are you the same as everyone else? Didn't you know already? The way mom died wasn't normal! Didn't you notice that her research was stolen by someone? Sojiro! When she passed away, I did think it was odd. It was awfully fishy. But what could I do? All I was able to do was run from it all. Run away, hide, and end up here as some old guy running a cafe. To be frank, I took you in for my own good. Like it'd somehow make up for what I'd done. Damn. It's basically my fault that you got burdened with all this crap. It's not your fault, Sojiro. I acted all big, lectured, even yelled at you kids. And I end up getting consoled by her. God, real pathetic, aren't I? That's not true. I mean, the one who killed Mom's the one at fault. <sighs> I see. Don't worry. Even if you are the real Phantom Thieves, I have no intention of reporting or kicking you out. <laughs> I mean, who would believe such a story? <laughs> Unless they catch you red-handed, it's impossible to explain that you're the Phantom Thieves. Let me just say one thing, though. Immediately back out of a fight that you can't win. Why? Just do as I say. If, by chance, you pissed off the same guys that killed Wakaba, then they're not someone that kids like you can deal with. Listen to reason, all right? We're done talking about this. Come on. Time to eat. All that yelling's gotten me hungry. Damn, you just gonna let it slide like that. Whew. If he turned us in, that would have jeopardized our operation. Still, we should tell the others about what just happened. Oh, I'm tired. <laughs> oh. What? He knows everything? You gotta be fucking kidding me. <gasps> wow, Ryuji... Ryuji actually said fuck. Holy crap. Alright. Wait, are you okay? Did, did he report you or anything? We likely wouldn't be receiving this message if Kiri was not okay. Feeling the boss was no ordinary man. He didn't recommend you turn himself in, did he? I think if that's the case, we can consider him a new ally. I'm more curious about what he mentioned to you. You mean how our enemy might be the same people who targeted Futaba's mom. Yeah, she was killed by mental shutdown. Same method we use, used by the culprit we pursued just now. Wait a second, though. Didn't you say boss had to run from it all? Does that mean someone was trying to stop the news from getting out? Who could do that? Who do you think the culprit could be? A government official? Ain't let your imagination run wild a bit, but it would make sense. Wait a sec. If you're right, that wouldn't it then wouldn't the police be working for him too? That's not impossible. This is getting too, too big for, for me to even think about. Can we really win this? We're gonna win, no matter what. Yeah, Sojiro's such a good character. Ugh. Because the chief had an inkling after all. Nice. Oh, hi Futaba, you're still here. It's my fault. All this happened because I kept the calling card. It's so late already. Go home or he'll worry. Yeah. Yep. Decide on catchy a catchy joining. Yep. Yeah, let's just go to bed. Whoa. Holy fuck. Actually, before we do that. 
Let's take a break. I want to take a BRB. I'm actually, <laughs> this is embarrassing. I'm still doing laundry, so I got to flip laundry and go to the bathroom and stretch. So I think this would be a good point to just take a quick, quick little brrr, like I have something. 10, whoops, like 10, 15 minute break or so. So, hi. Yeah, good, yeah, good time to BRB after all that shit. <laughs> Alright, I will be back. Shifter, 
All right. Welcome back, everyone. I hope we've all stretched, went to the bathroom, got your snacks, drinks, all that good shit. All right. Do this on performance mode, and yeah. Let's continue. Well then. As we dive deeper into this <laughs> this rabbit hole. That concludes the speech given by Representative Masayoshi Shido, who may be forming a new party. New party? We now resume our coverage of the Phantom Thieves, the suspects for Mr. Okumura's death and others. The police have designated the Phantom Thieves as the country's most wanted fugitives. Yes, back to the drama. And have decided to reward anyone with information leading to the capture of the Phantom Thieves. Look. Those who provide information will be offered a reward of 30 million yen. And considering the high amount, it shows how extraordinary the situation has become. Reward money will be supplied by the police and the families of the victims. Further, mm -hmm. if I report you to the police and they arrest you, I supposedly get 30 <laughs> million yen for it. Oh, shit. No. That's insane. I hope you understand the situation you're in. Even people who didn't have an interest before will be on the lookout for the Phantom Thieves. And it'll happen every day, even at school. Why did this happen? I'm sorry. This isn't about me. Well, how do I put this? I'm sorry I didn't realize it. It's also my responsibility. Also, Spooky that this is happened. here to. All I can do now yeah. <laughs> is Spook is here. Just don't become desperate and do something reckless, all right? I don't know. I don't know, Sojiro. I won't sell you out. As long as you're here, there's nothing to worry about. I feel bad about what we've done to the chief. I'm responsible, too. Mm. Did you see that reward? <laughs> Perhaps we put too much pressure on them. With this, the Phantom Thieves have become public enemy number one. <laughs> exactly. That will be when their curtain falls. <laughs> oh. Hey, great! Silly little furball. She's not a little furball, she's a big furball. <laughs> Yo, you see the news? Brace myself for the possibility. Actually, having a wanted notice out for us feels kind of weird. Let's talk more in person. We're wanted now, and the reward's 30 million yen? What is this, a comic book? <laughs> it feels so unrealistic, I can't help but laugh. We are finally being treated as actual criminals. I'm positive now. Remember all of those what-ifs I mentioned before? All of this was truly set up. How President Okumura ranked first, the fad before that, even Mechev. <laughs> it was all to make the Phantom Thieves famous. On top of that, we were lured to target Okumura. Yeah, the enemy likely planned to lay the blame on us from the start, after we gained popularity. Then what about everything we've done until now? Are the people whose hearts we changed and thought were corrupt actually not? No, because of Yusuke and I, the Matarame and Kanashiro cases were coincidental. Wasn't that the case with Kamashida too, considering what happened with the rankings? Only the previous target would have been used to lure us. What a cheap trick to use. Cheap? It's nothing of the sort. There's the fake Medjad and the site's altercation. They might have even engineered the fat around us. So much time and effort has been put into this. President Okumura probably wasn't their only target. Perhaps they intend to place all blame of past and future psychotic breakdowns on our group. 
That's why I said we shouldn't jump into things so carelessly. What, so this is my fault? Even you agreed to it in the end. And there was that thing with Haru at the time. How are we supposed to ignore that, huh? I'm sorry. This was all because I once... Nanako, get daddy another beer. I seemed really serious as shock. Yeah, think for about real. Was my fiance. Thank you for the follow. I don't know why if my I'd sound isn't working. I've only been able to cope with it more calmly. I have like a little sound Haru? that goes off, but... It's, it's not working Haru's tonight fault. for some reason, but yes, thank you. I should you. have spoken up too when Principal Kabayakawa died. Damn it! This is bullshit! God! Fuck! Oh my god, Ryuji. Ryuji! Taking out your frustration on things doesn't help anyone! The noise worked for that? Hey. I didn't hear it on my what end. Why did we lose? What did we do oh, wrong? Oh, shoot. I, I didn't hear it at all. Huh. It's probably because... We weren't it was loud? Oh. Agreed. Hmm. At the time, we only cared about the opinion of yeah, the general I don't... public. Yeah. Sorry, guys. I didn't that realize really that. Isn't. <laughs> I was so caught up in making a name for ourselves. I'll have to look I'm into this after the stream. I became a phantom thief because I hated those same kinds of adults. To think we had begun clinging onto fame and a place to belong that our eyes had become clouded. We were meant to be the righteous phantom thieves, but we lost sight of our original cause. I'm so irritated with myself. Makoto. Damn it. I know that we've been set up, and that I was a complete idiot too, but still, it's so damn frustrating. Of course I want to do something about this. Yeah, we'll be in deep water at this rate. However, we have no idea who we're up against, and whether they're an individual or an organization. Furthermore, they must be in a position of power, or have powerful backers if they can go so far. Are we really a match for this? Should we end this now? Uh-oh. Are they I mean, breaking up? Things might get worse for everyone. Hey, what should we do? We'll overcome this. Get we yeah. need a catchy. <laughs> Running away with our tails between our legs is exactly what they want. We'd be dumping everything we stand for just to save our own asses. I see. I take back what I just said. I can't let it end like this. Absolutely not like this. Looks like we're settled on what we want to do. All that's left is how we go about it. Yeah. Hey, uh, it's me. Oh. Hi, Ryuji. Um, about me yelling earlier, being framed, and the added bounty, it all felt like such bullshit. I lost it. I'm sorry. I know how you feel. You too? It is confusing. We're wanted criminals now. Maybe I haven't changed at all since that time we went up against Kamoshida. I wanted to be a phantom thief because I thought even someone like me could be a hero. It made me so happy to be depended on. Guess all went straight to my head. I thought I could do anything if it was for justice, but that'd make me no different from our targets. I called them shitbags, but I must be the shittiest of shitbags. I can't even joke about it. You can still change. You're right. I can start by changing who I am now. Thanks. I feel like I can think straight now. Oh, I scared Haru and Futaba, didn't I? I'll have to apologize to them soon. See ya. More messages? I got a message from Akechi Kun. He wants to gather at LeBlanc tomorrow after school. Tomorrow, that sentence is directly after the reward announcement. Must be calculated. We've reached a crucial moment. There's no point fretting about it now, though. Let's just stay calm and wait for tomorrow. Okay. Can't let things end here. Nice. Actually, I'm almost done with the book. Read. Hey. 
I want my Make kindness sure to go up. up. I need that shit to max out. Wow. Oh. Mm -hmm. Oh, come on. At least it helped, but still. Free? An issue in which criminals do whatever they want under the name of justice cannot be left alone. Only now does the government speak of taking countermeasures, but their actions are too little, too late. The government as it stands has been left behind the times. It is obsolete! <laughs> we don't have to go down with a sinking ship. We have the power to change this! Let us end this chaos! Through my hands and yours! He's a politician of the ruling party, isn't he? I heard they're splitting up to form a new party, so an election might come before the year's end. Oh, I'm gonna shit. vote this time for sure. This man has my support. You haven't voted until now? That's problematic as a member of society, you know. Politics just never interested me before. But this politician seems pretty amazing. He's passionate and thinks of the future. I mean, someone like <laughs> that should be prime minister. I'm definitely voting for him. Oh, jeez. Well, I suppose that makes sense, since the other politician seems so unreliable. When you say that you want us to cooperate with you, what exactly do you intend us to do? That's a good question. But might I have a cup of coffee first? No. <laughs> Quit effing around! No, you Please may not have coffee. Short. There's a bounty for information in addition to the arrest warrant. Those are quite desperate measures. I'm referring to Sai-san's actions. I assume all of you are at your wit's end as well. She must be considerably vexed if she's gone that far. Make headlines with the arrest warrant, then use incentives to get testimonies. It's not a bad method. The police have nothing on us. There's no way they can make an arrest. True. I'm the only one who's ascertained your true identities. However, the groundwork for fabricating testimonies and concocting a culprit are underway. We don't care about that self-gratification. Get on with it. <laughs> I'll be blunt. I'm thinking of triggering a change of heart in Sai Sun. Oh. I've already discovered that she has a palace. Hmm. Huh? Really? Is this to prevent the investigation agency's recklessness? Precisely. Still, there's no need to change her heart just for that. Indeed. It's hard to believe that a single person can fabricate all that. Unfortunately, that's not the case. What if I told you that those around her would turn a blind eye to false evidence? You saying the police would do such a thing? It seems they're more trusted than I thought. Their priority is settling the situation. They don't care who the supposed culprit is. No! You're completely rotten! My objective is to find the true culprit. That must be the case for all of you too. However, the current situation is extremely bad. If worse comes to worst, someone unrelated will be set up as the culprit, huh? Our only solution to this is to make Sai San come to <laughs> her Kevin senses. Gooden, if catchy. she's in her yeah. right mind, she can stop this situation. Her sense of justice wouldn't allow it. So that's why... The truth will be covered up. And an innocent civilian's life will be destroyed. I can't allow such a thing to happen. My own ethics won't stand for it. I mean... I guess I can understand how you feel. And changing Sai-san's heart will be to protect her as well. How do you mean? If the true culprit were to learn that she's responsible for the investigation, what would happen? I'm certain they'll aim for her life. She's the perfect target to place blame on the Phantom Thieves. So how about it? Will you agree to my plan? Even though you're particular about being just, you're willing to get your hands dirty? It can't be helped in order to ascertain the truth. There is also one more merit in changing Sai-san's heart. Hmm. 
She'll be a fine warning to others not to meddle with you any further. They can't go public if someone in the investigation has a change of heart. It'd show their corruption. All that's left from there is for me to discover the identity of the true culprit. Bruh. <sighs> what do you mean? You're gonna tell us to announce our disbandment once the real culprit is arrested, aren't you? As expected from Anijima. So, what do you say? I don't think it's a bad deal for either of us. Makoto, what's your take on all this? It's a well-made plan. It even takes putting an end to our team into consideration. I'm flattered to hear that. Bruh. Why are you willing to do all this, Akechi-kun? Why do you seek justice? Because of sickening human beings. Yes. My contempt for such people drives my sense of justice. It isn't some grand reason like society's sake or some lofty ideal. It's simply an absurd grudge. And extremely personal. Dude. <laughs> you know, doesn't he remind you of us? <laughs> you think? I can't really explain it. But I guess it's how some disgusting adult pissed him off. We're similar, hmm? Maybe that's why I thought that I could ask this of you all. Won't you cooperate with me on the mission to change Sai San's heart? We will. Thanks. <laughs> I was actually rather worried there. This mission can't succeed without your cooperation, after all. The Phantom Thieves will be disbanded, and everything will work out. I pray it does. Mako-chan. I'm okay. I never brought it up until now. But the reason I joined the Phantom Thieves is... Because I wanted to change my sister's heart. I was hoping I wouldn't have to resort to it, though. I've also known for quite some time that she has a palace. Why didn't you tell us? It was too selfish of a reason. Though I was too scared to look any further into it on my own. Why don't we try going there now to scope the place out? Oh, shit. A lot of this will be new to me. So I'd like to get myself accustomed Man, to it, too. Man, we just go right in. <laughs> I I'm sorry. I actually have plans today. Oh, I see. That's unfortunate. Will you tell your sister about this? Of course not. It's just... You seem awfully evasive today. Is something the matter? I just can't make time today. Let's call it a day then, and resume this tomorrow. I'm sorry, everyone. Yeah, we have a lot of team members here. Goddamn. Wasn't Makoto acting a bit weird? This is about her sister, I mean, like, it's serious. Well, I guess that can't be helped. Regardless, it all starts tomorrow. I hope this goes well. Oh shit. That Goro Akechi? Then the Phantom Thieves targeted me as per his advice? And he had already experienced the metaverse by the time of the Okumura case? That can't be. I mean, he never said a word. Although, <laughs> his attitude did change suddenly around that time. Akechi couldn't kept quiet about the most important details, and my own sister may be a Phantom Thief? If this is all true, I was out of the loop the entire time I led the investigation. What a joke. So you became convinced of another's existence through the two mental shutdown cases. And if you were apprehended while falsely accused of those crimes, that villain would still be loose. That's why you targeted me? Not for your own preservation? That's right. That does make sense, more or less. If you simply wanted to evade capture, triggering my change of heart wouldn't guarantee anything. Your actions as phantom thieves would still be met with hostility. No. If this villain does exist and is setting up your group, I would be targeted next. Did Makoto come up with that speculation? What are you talking about? <laughs> Perhaps I'm overthinking things. Oh, 
shit. Hey, you need to keep your focus. It seems you're completely worn out, but the look on your face isn't one of defeat. Why is that? I haven't lost yet. I'm amazed. It seems you can still talk. When you were arrested, a man at the scene told you that you were sold out, correct? Those words normally hint at the existence of a traitor. However, if your story till now is true, one reason can be concluded. It's frustrating to admit, but at a certain point... No, most likely from the start. I was a mere puppet. Someone set up only to bear responsibility later. Someone intended your arrest, and the minimal staff directly involved were in their pocket. And if that's the case, true integrity would side with you. Sai is slowly starting to accept the truth. I feel my bond with Sai is growing deeper. All right. All right. No, I'm jumping to conclusions. I don't believe your story yet. There's something I need to confirm with you. Was a change of heart triggered in me? What happened in the time between entering my palace and your arrest? Tell me everything. All right. What's this favor you need? It's late already. We'll be going to Nijima's palace, so I want to look into her. Things like her work ethic and relationships. It doesn't matter whether it's public or private. Those would help us come up with countermeasures in case we hit a roadblock in her palace. I can look up more, you know. Stuff like her repertoire of underwear. <laughs> a girl shouldn't say things Bruh. like that. You tell her too. <laughs> Don't do that. I thought you'd like that. <laughs> Would this also, be a good jumping off point? Getting tired. Uh, voice. maybe. Not sure, but Ow. hey, if you're tired, you're tired. Same I don't as mind. Always. Let me finish first. <sighs> There's something else we want you to look into. <gasps> what? Why is this getting blurry? This is what? The fuck? Bruh. Let work on it, please. Where are we meeting up today? Courthouse. We're going to the courthouse. Yeah, I'm gonna dip. Good night, everybody. Have a good night. Sleep well. So this is the courthouse. You can tell it's a revolting building just by looking at it. Let's hurry up and get started. Akechi, what did you find out? I rarely get to see Sai-san directly, but I figured out her course of action. On the 20th, an investigation will likely be done at Shujin Academy, as well as the Sakura residence. Oh. Real? Then that means our time limit is November 20th. Still, there will be quite a bit of red tape involved. I doubt it'll take place before the 20th. We'll take your word. For now, we need to focus on infiltrating her palace. I concur. And we should probably get going soon. After all, people like us standing around here is quite unnatural. Well then? <laughs> Shall we? <gasps> That's... Huh? What about my smartphone? Oh, oh shit. This is the model I wanted. You're so lucky. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Until recently, Futaba was actually a... Well... It's okay. Sai-san told me the gist. Oh, right. Akechi-kun, it may be best if you exchange contact info with everyone, too. Not just me. 
That's true. <laughs> I'll send everyone's contacts to you later. Thanks. <laughs> Can I have my phone back? No. Well then, I hope we get along. I'll do my best. <laughs> you got a good personality and good looks? Talk about cheating. Uh, <laughs> She's praising you, I believe. <laughs> then shall we get started? We need to figure out what Makoto's sis thinks this courthouse is, right? I often hear her call it a place of competition in which she must always win. A competition, huh? That sounds like Sai-san. It'd be unbearable if you were put on trial for a reason like that. Although, a competition means it's a match of some sort. Might it be a martial arts ring? Conditions have not been met. Then, perhaps a stadium? Or maybe an arena? There are other competitions besides fighting and sports. Gambling, then. Mm. How about a racetrack for horses? Other than that, there's pachinko, but does that count as gambling? We played cards <laughs> during the school trip. Conditions have not been met. What else is there? It must be a casino. Candidate found. Oh, shit. I definitely see Sai-san in you. Oof. Well, it's time we head in then. Beginning navigation. Oh boy, here we go. Two <gasps> D cutscene. Two D cutscene. Two D cutscene. Head right past there and keep a low profile. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, huh? What's going on here? We are looking at the courthouse, aren't we? <laughs> Seems like it. Let's go. Right. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Everywhere else seems to be a normal cityscape. Isn't that... The police station, yes. I didn't know that the station and the courthouse were next <laughs> to each other. That's the biggest trip. Our attire hasn't changed. That must mean we aren't considered threats or hostiles yet. Right. Areas outside her courthouse palace must not be worthy of her attention. Wait, I always look like this. I'm special. Besides, I can't do anything in my cat form. The police station's also part of her work area, though. Whenever arrests are made for her cases. I brought her food and belongings when she was sent on loan to the police. We got no business with the cops, right? This might be the metaverse, but I don't want to go in a station. <laughs> that reminds me. He'll need a code name, too. Code name? Sand oh, yeah. thieves can't go around using the real names, right? It ain't cool either. Just for reference, what is everyone else's? Skull. Mine's Fox. <laughs> we pretty much decided on them with how we look, didn't we? What is it, Haru? Uh, oh, it's nothing. What? Then perhaps Karasu will be best for me. You know, like a raven. <laughs> Are your clothes all black or something? The reverse, actually. If our code names are to hide our identities, wouldn't that be better? Karasu. He'd be the only Japanese sounding one. Why not go with Crow instead? All right. From here on out, you're Crow. All right. Got it. Now then, let's head into the courthouse. Now then. Yes. New song, new song, new song. Oh, I'm so excited. Let's, do Let's it. save real quick, but. Oh, I'm so excited for this. You have no idea. Somewhere. 
Wait. Let's find another room. This means we're acknowledged as a threat, correct? Dude, <laughs> yeah, seriously. Stuff in that Turn go? it up! It just means that's what he thinks a rebel looks like. No. This is my mental image of a person who sticks to their justice. Well, I think your mask is more apt for piercing rather than sticking. <laughs> that aside, the people in here look completely normal. But we're in a flashy casino. There's no doubt this is a palace. Oh, right. Crow doesn't know too much about cognitive beings, does he? Ah, yes. In addition to similar topography, cognitive people exist based on the ruler's perceptions. That probably didn't make much sense because all the fancy terms he was using, huh? In essence, since these look like real people, Saison's view of others is surprisingly undistorted. Considering what I see before me, it's difficult to believe it is not actually a real casino. Not all cognitions are normal, though. In Futaba and Okumura's palaces, we had to battle them. People may look normal, but we should be careful. Particularly of those in positions of power. Is this what you have to go through every time? <laughs> yes, every time. <laughs> hmm. This is a first for me. I'm somewhat nervous. Just don't slow us down, Crow. I will not allow that to happen. Okay, it's time we head inside. Our deadline for this infiltration is November 20th. Any later and we'll get caught in reality. Of course, we'll need to secure an infiltration route before we send out the calling card. As always. So the calling card wasn't merely for show? It's a necessary step? <laughs> Will you please stop interrupting? Oh yeah, sorry about the uh, AC. Mm, apologies. It's uh it's been well, very hot lately. Let's go. Human more than anything. I feel somewhat nervous. Alright. Somewhere. Let's go. This is blocked. Ah, here we go. Welcome. Come on out, you petty thieves. Oh. She can see us? You're after the treasure, are you not? Come on down, and I will tell you where it is. What? We're not going to fall for a trick like that. <laughs> it's not a lie. I only wish to do this fair and square. You aren't going to run, are you? We should do as she says. There is no point in hiding any longer. Are we still- oh. I'm still- I'm not gonna worry about it right now. I didn't realize I'm still in my Persona 2 costumes. <laughs> or for everybody else, at least. So you <gasps> Yo! The treasure is located on the manager's floor. Guffy. Guffy. Why are you telling us this? It's as I said before. I wish to go about this in the fairest manner possible. First, I <laughs> Damn girl slay. to my location. We will continue this there. Oh. Damn it, over there. 
It seems we'll be able to use that elevator to reach higher floors. Come, Joker. Let us pursue her. Let us get after her. All right, all right. First, equip. Yeah, we're changing everybody's costumes back. I think that's only appropriate, especially for this um, this one. And, yeah, we've also got Akechi. We have so many freaking members now. Holy shit. Alright, everyone's back to their normal gear. Cool. What's up here? Oh. Not worth it. See it. No the winds of fate may lead us. Yeah, when I first heard this song, I was like I was like, oh <laughs> He sounds so excited, yeah. Can I go in here? Hmm. What's huh? Is there a oh, safe room. I'll just add this. Huh. I'm wondering, do I start the palace next stream? Because I'm wondering if this would be a good place to stop. Because, I mean, well, the other thing, too, is I don't want to stay up too terribly late, and it's already, like, almost 12.30. So... Let's do it. You know what? I think this will be a good place to stop. For the night. Um... I know I don't work late tomorrow, so I might be able to play... Play more tomorrow night. We just started. Yeah, good stopping point. I agree. Alright, well... New palace time. Well, I could get carried away from the grind. Yeah, for real. Alrighty, well, good ass stopping point. <laughs> Alright, well, thank you all for watching tonight. And, uh, yeah, I will see you all next time.